Hey everyone, it's Freddie again, and I'm here to give you our third update for this uh, 2019 uh, Superbike project for the shop here. Again, I'm here after hours because we've been uh, working overtime uh, to get everything ready for this race weekend that we're trying to do this weekend. So we've got some updates today for sure. Uh, we'll start with, uh, we got our 2019 bike in, which is this guy right here. That's the 2019 ZX-10 RR. Um, it's definitely here too late for us to, to use this time, but, uh, you know what, at least it made it and, uh, we can get to work on this thing immediately when we get back. And then of course we have what we are going to be using this weekend, which is our 2019 ZX-10 double R super bike, which has most of the good stuff that we're going to be using. Well, I, I would say over half at least on the new bike. So we have all of our suspension brakes, uh, most of the chassis stuff, swing arm, as you can see, is in place there looking awesome. And fortunately this, we had just refreshed this motor. We actually didn't have a cylinder head for it because we're getting some work done trying some things out. So we had to borrow a cylinder head for this bike. So, um, that we were a little worried about that because we just sort of like had to rush this together because of the circumstances here that we've outlined in the previous video. So, uh, we got it on the dyno today and it looks really good. So it's uh, definitely going to run strong. And um, like I say, we have most of the really cool stuff and we're definitely going to be able to test. The key thing is going to be testing out this linkage that we're trying here with the swing arm. Totally different, obviously. Completely different shock absorber. Uh, this fork is completely different from what we had before with the gas fork. Now we're on the spring pressurized system. So we got a lot of stuff that we're going to be able to try out and gain valuable data aside from our electronics that we don't yet have and UPS doesn't yet know where it is. And uh, so uh, it's still going to be a productive weekend. And this thing, I, I must say, it looks fantastic. I mean, this motorcycle just looks the business. I'm going to do a walk around so you can kind of just get a look at this thing. But it really just looks the part. So if it looks, if it goes half as well as it looks, then uh, we're going to be in business for sure. Still a little bit, a few things to tidy up. And we had some small issues. Our uh, our wide bando two that we use on this had gone bad. Um, so, you know, that's why we that's why we try to do things before we get to the track and try to get all that stuff out of the way. So fortunately, it looks like we're in good business. We're again, so the, the main difference aside from this thing has a completely different specification engine with the new tie rods and such. The uh, this we're using the standard gearbox we're not using. Um, the very special gearbox that we're going to be using in our uh, 2019 bike. Um, this has basically a flashed kit ECU. Um, and there's a few other little things we'll go into later that are going to kind of differentiate this guy from this guy. But uh, a lot of cool stuff. And uh, hopefully we have a nice weekend racing and gain some valuable data for when we get the, the rest of our parts in. So stay tuned. We should have an update for you soon. Maybe we'll make some videos at the track if things are... Uh, not too hectic. We'll try and, and get some good footage for you there. So we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching.